Who's this guy? He's Jeff Dunham. Who's with the dummy? Just watch. You'll understand. Oh, it is good to be here. My name is Jeff Dunham. I'm not your typical stand-up comedian. Uh, I have to have help. I have a friend up here. I think audiences enjoy this guy because everyone knows someone like this. You know someone like this in your own family or where you work? Please help me welcome Walter. Good evening, Walter. Ah, oh, shut the hell up. <laughs> you know where we are? Yeah, I know where we are. I don't give a damn either. <laughs> Just want to get the hell out of here. Where do you want to go? Who the hell cares? I don't care. <laughs> but you like it here in Montreal. Montreal. <laughs> Bonjour. Whatever the hell that means. <laughs> but you do like you do like Montreal. Yeah, a lot of drinking going on here. Yeah, yeah. Budweiser's considered a soda. <laughs> yeah, I was in a bar last night, sitting next to a guy. He put away 15 beers before he started acting like a jerk. You didn't try and keep up with him, did you? Come on, man, I'm an American. I don't need beer to act like a jerk. <laughs> Shut the hell up. <laughs> if you don't want to stay, where do you want to go? I don't care. How about where you went last weekend? No, I don't want to talk about that. It was very nice. Walter and his wife went on their second honeymoon. Yeah. <laughs> it's like eating a piece of gum you already chewed. See, they know what I'm talking about. <laughs> well, Walter, I understand your wife's in town. Yeah, she's in town. She's been having a good time. Oh, she always has a good time. It pisses me off. <laughs> you two have been married, what, 46 years? That's right. Do you remember the happiest moment of your life? Yeah, it was 47 years ago. <laughs> Walter, well, you seem a little extra grumpy. Yeah, I don't know what it is. Maybe too much brain. Too much brain that you make you regular. Regular hell, I'm about three years ahead of schedule. <laughs> Come on, 46 years of marriage. What has that done for you? Look at my face. <laughs> Walter, you make fun of your wife a lot. You know, she could be gone for good one day. Stop teasing me. You ever cheated on her? Hell no. Damn it. <laughs> you know, Walter, marriage is supposed to be forever. Well, it's taken too damn long. <laughs> so I take it there's been a little bit of arguing? A little bit. What do you argue about? She doesn't like it because I never put the toilet seat back down. What do you tell her? Learn to hover. <laughs> What else does she not like? I don't know, I always pick my nose and I'm driving. <laughs> That's a man's right, dang blasted. <laughs> Why do you pick your nose when you're driving? Because my ass is too hard to reach. <laughs> Walter Mayer. <laughs> Marriage is supposed to be an institution. Yeah, like Alcatraz. <laughs> you can't compare marriage to prison. Yeah, I guess you're right. The warden doesn't max out your credit cards. <laughs> so that happens. She buys some of those useless crap. You know what she got me the other day? What? Some of that spray-on hair stuff. <laughs> Did you use it? On our chihuahua. <laughs> Turn it into a shit zoo. <laughs> Walter, do you think about getting old? I don't worry about it. I figure I want to go like my uncle did. How was that? Peacefully and in his sleep. Unlike the passengers in his car. <laughs> Sit the hell down. <laughs> Sit the hell down, damn it. Do you have a ticket? 
Ле, 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 ле. 300 million sperm, that's the one that got through, right? So. The wheel is turning, but the hamster's dead. <laughs> Look, Walter, do you have kids? Yeah, I got kids. What'd they give you for Father's Day? A card, said I wasn't really their father. <laughs> that's awful. No, that's what I asked for. <laughs> Yeah, my nice stupid son. You know what he wanted to get me? What, a tattoo? Did you get one? No. What if you had? Oh, I would have gotten a beautiful woman's face. Uh, where would you have put it? On my wife's face. <laughs> yeah, my wife got me a book on reincarnation. Uh, do you believe in reincarnation? Yeah, I don't think so. Well, if it happens, who would you come back as? What would you do? I'd come back as my wife and leave me the hell alone. <laughs> well, Walter, how's your love life? You mean sex? Yeah, none. None? None. I thought making love got better with age. Hang on to that, green pal. <laughs> well, do bald men make better lovers? I don't know. I never made love to a bald man. <laughs> what the hell is wrong with you? Stop looking at me like that, sir. Oh, Walter, what's the difference between just sex and making love? Fifty bucks. <laughs> Look, I don't mean to get personal, but how many, how many times a week do you and your wife make love? Times a week? <laughs> I'm going to have to use a decimal to answer this one. <laughs> Walter, you just seem like a spry kind of guy. I mean, what, what keeps you hopping? Hemorrhoids. <laughs> oh, so at your age, hemorrhoids are a problem? No, they're a hobby. What do you think? <laughs> Look, Walter, what, what do you think about when you're making love? Staying awake? <laughs> or well, look, that guy's wife just poked him. <laughs> We'll see you.